my practical experience initially was as a classroom teacher. So I was a dual language teacher in Chicago and in Mexico City for several years in bilingual schools. And that's when I started noticing that, wow, the kids who are on IPs and the kids who identified as English learners aren't necessarily the kids who I'm noticing in the classroom that are struggling to learn um, how to read. I also noticed that some of that some of the kids that I thought needed additional support weren't getting it. That is so common. So in so many of the districts that I'm working in, they have, if not an explicit rule, sort of a de facto rule that you have to give teachers um, have to give students three years in the district before they can be referred for intervention. So it truly is an equity issue um, because we don't make it. Other groups wait before they can be seen for a disability. Everything we know about literacy, so I study language and its connection to literacy, everything we know about literacy development is that intervening early, it gives you so much bang for your buck. And if you're not learning how to decode fluently until after third grade, you are at a real disadvantage um, when you pass this transition from learning to read to reading to learn.